Yo, what's up? This your boy Derek Branch here, Strike7Sports.com. And I'm back with another video. Um coming off, fresh coming off of the um two-point victory over Vanderbilt on Saturday. Um Memphis is currently on a five-game winning streak, and with that five-game winning streak and the victories they've they've had over opponents like Texas AM, Clemson. Virginia, Virginia, and recently, you know, Vanderbilt, even though Vanderbilt is not having a good year right now, the Tigers moved up in the um, top 25 rankings from 23 to 19. And a lot of people were talking after that game with uh, Vanderbilt and how they barely won and how they didn't come out, they didn't look focused, or they didn't play as a team. In that game, and could, could, um, complaining about David Jones, even though David Jones is there, like is the best player on the team right now, and you know he's done so much for the team, and people, you know, fuss about him not passing and things like that. Um, people, you know, one comment, um, one notion that I saw that I kind of find interesting. Somebody said that. Can't think of who it was, but they were saying that Memphis is down instead of instead of the hunter in you know college basketball in their pursuit of you know playing at the highest level, which is you know the NCAA tournament, which is you know deep into the NCAA tournament, and you know they're no longer the hunters, and teams are giving them the best you know, shot every time they play and, you know, because of their rankings and people got team because of their, they're moving up in the rankings now. Teams are going to be gunning for them and I think they're a little bit of the hunter and they're a little bit of the hunted. You know, um, even before the rankings, you know, even before they got included in the rankings, um, Memphis teams were were getting up for Memphis. You know what I'm saying? Teams, you know, programs did a lot of promotion on social media, a lot of hype videos, talking about playing Memphis. You know, you could you know, um, when they played Missouri, that was a sold out sold out arena. When they played um, Ole Miss, that was a sold out arena. When he played um, Texas A&M, that was a sold out arena. When he, even when he played um, VCU, people got up for that game. That was a pack house after after you know once it was all said and done. So to me, it's still a little mixture of both, you know, because well, for whatever reason, I don't know if it's because of the chat on social media or just hype in general. Teams, regardless of who it is, have Memphis Circle on their calendar. They really do. And and if we're being honest, Memphis is the defending, the, the reigning defending, all the American Athletic Conference champions, men's basketball champions. They are the AAC tournament champions. They represent the conference along with Houston. Well, when Houston was a part of the American in the NCAA tournament last season, they are the defending champions. They're holding the crown. But, however, Florida Atlantic, FAU, they get, that's, because of, that's because they went to the Final Four last year. That enhanced their profile. That enhanced their profile. Is a team, it's a program that they brought everybody's bringing back. They brought they brought all the player a significant bulk of their players back from last season. So they're getting they're getting a lot of a shine. So they to me, they're like considered a hundred. And they're not and they didn't even win the conference last year because you know they weren't a part of the conference. But team, the people view them as the top team in the conference in the AAC. They they got ranked. After being in Arizona this week, this past week, 
they jumped up in the, and they jumped up to like their highest ranking in like forever. You know, you know they beat a number of four rank, a number four rank Arizona, and I saw some people complaining about why Memphis didn't move up because Memphis wasn't ranked when they beat Clemson. Why they didn't get jumped up to the rankings like that? It just, I mean, you compare. It's more about a brand. It's more about brand awareness after when you get to that point. You know, compare Clem Clemson's brand in college basketball to Arizona. Arizona's been at this for a long time compared to Clemson. You know, and um, uh, Clemson, Clemson got it's ranked that they dropped from they were thirteen. I dropped to eighteen. They're right behind. Uh, they're right in front of Memphis, who they did beat. You know, Florida Atlantic jumped up. I mean, has be jumped up because they beat the fourth ranked team in the country, the um, a high ranked um Arizona team. You know, so they're gonna get that type of shine, bro. They're gonna get that type of attention based on what they have done over these last couple of months, dating back to last season. They like the hundred. They're the hundred. Memphis, Memphis right now is a little bit of is a little bit of both. Teams like to play Memphis. Teams get up to play Memphis, and when they play them, they give it. They give it the good teams, the good opponents. Give them their best shot. Even the 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 the, the um the lower tier team, lower tier programs right now. The Teams that are not so good, that got bad records. Look at uh, what happened with Vanderbilt. Pushed them to the limit, you know. That, that game had multiple lead changes in it. And then but Vanderbilt at the time was what, 4-7? and seven? Memphis 23rd, we were ranked 23rd in the country. Four-game winning streak. Just beat Virginia. Just beat um, Clemson. Beat A&M about a week ago, a few weeks ago. So... Is um did Memphis is a, is a combination of both, if you ask me. You know, and when I was at the post, I was at the game. I was you know covering the game for Strike Seven Sports, and I went to the post game presser, and kind of Penny Hardaway kind of attribute that um the sluggish just on why they were so, you know, slow to you know get going in the um matchup against um uh, Vanderbilt is because of um the team has just been tired. You know, it just. They've been going hard for the last couple of days, you know, played a hard game against um, uh, Clemson. You know, even though they blew them out, they blew out um, Virginia, you know, they got it. They, they put it in work, you know what I'm saying? So it is what it is, man. But I still think, I think FAU is the hunted. FAU is the hunted because of the hype that they received. The um the accolades that they constantly get, you know, they're moving up. They're like the the seven ranked team in the country right now. You know, they're not they're not to defend the champions of the AAC, but team the people, the voters, all that, the media are treating it, treating them like they're the, 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 they're the defending champions, even though they come from a different conference. You know, now however they did won the conference USA on title last season. You know, and they, but they're no longer a part of that conference, they're part of the American, but people project them as the, the favorites to win it. But we'll see how it's going to play out, man. But as of now, man, like I said, Memphis is still is the, is the hunter and the hunted. They're a mixture of both. So there's that. You know, um, they play um, the last game of the um, non-conference slate this um, week on Saturday, I believe. Yeah, it's against um, – all day. So we'll see how that one play out. Hopefully it'll be um fresh by in. Everybody be coming up for break and be ready to lock, locked in and ready to go. So we'll see. All right, so that's y'all for right now, man. Give me a like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Let me know how you feel. Do you still think Memphis is the is the hunter? Is the hunter? Or do you believe that they're now the hunted now in college basketball? And also check out strikesummersports.com for latest content on NFL, the NBA. Memphis Tigers football and basketball programs and much more. Have a blessed day. Peace. I'm out. Be safe.